Okay, so now you can't see anything at all. Um, if I yell, you can see my, my uh, thing lights up. Hey, this is Doug from Doug and Nikki, and I am getting ready to go to a black white party kind of thing for New Year's Eve and I thought this shirt looked like it would be a ton of fun. So what we're gonna do in this video is we're gonna test it out under a couple different environments and then we are going to, which will include, here we are in the basic light so you know what it looks like and right now it is on so you could see the it moving a little bit. It is seems to be a little less sensitive than I thought it would be. So you gotta really mount it somewhere where the speaker can hear, as you can see. Hold on a sec. Or you gotta talk really loud, which I think will be fine at a party, right? With the music on. So I will say one negative thing about this is this clip is absolute crap. I mean, I understand the clip is located on this little device right where the battery thing is so it has to be like removable so you could put batteries in and out but then it works like crap so all right so okay so now as I was saying we're gonna test it out here under normal light we're gonna turn out the light so you could see what it looks like without a black light and see if maybe you could see what the reaction looks like here on the shirt and then finally we're gonna turn on some black lights and see what it looks like and then at the end, I'm gonna give you Doug score from one to five and talk to you about the fit and finish and how it feels, comfort, that kind of stuff. All right, so let's get on with it. Let's try, let's have the beautiful assistant, the beautiful Miss Nicole, turn the lights out and see what it looks like. Okay, so now you can't see anything at all. Um, if I yell, you could see my, my uh, thing lights up. Let me pull it, if I tap on it like that, you could see it light up. So it'll be interesting to see what it is like in a party in a normal kind of conversation, even if you're yelling, it barely picks it up. I will say that much. And it is on full sensitivity. All right, so we're trying some black lights and I have some massive black lights here because we just got them to set up this whole party thing. I can barely see it so bright. All right, so now I have two enormous black lights on and I don't know how it looks. Here are the way the lights are. Let me stand right in front of the light. Does it make any difference? No, it's okay. It's okay? You can see it? I you can't can, see. I'm can, looking. You can definitely see it. Is there it. anything on the back? No. Okay, so it's just black in the back. You can so, definitely see the, you know, the headphones light up more. You, oh, you can see the headphones light yeah, up more? Yeah, they're very bright. Oh, yeah, okay, I got gotcha, you. They're neon. They're neon. Okay, so this is what it looks like when you're at the party under black light situations. All right, let's turn the light back on and talk about the fit and finish. So, okay, I am typically an XL on normal kind of stuff, but when I buy t-shirts and stuff from Amazon, which are probably coming from China, I normally size up to a double XL. I will say it is very weird the way this is cut. The sleeves and arm area here are definitely too big, but this area here and the shoulders even are kind of more in line with what an XL would be. So I kind of feel like if I went down to an XL, it would be um, too tight here. The arms, the sleeves might fit right in that situation, but the rest of it would be too small. It is definitely an unusual cut. I, I have not experienced this before. I was thinking I was just gonna talk about size, whether it's too big or too small. And, I, and it really, I just kind of don't really like the cut so much. In any case, I'm gonna give this, I'm only gonna give it a two out of five on the Doug score, not to be mean or anything, but I don't find the cut to be terribly comfortable. I find the fact that I have to work so hard to get this cool thing to light up is a little annoying. Um, so I'm not really a huge fan. You may like it, it may work better for you, may be perfect for you, but for me, uh, I've seen better. So I'm gonna give it that two out of five on the Doug score. I hope that was helpful. We'll see you next time.